Oh. Yeah. Oh, look at look that. At that. Hey, what? Today, I am back to make a DIY giant sour gummy worm. To be specific, I'm making the sourest gummy worm in the world because you see these little gummy worms getting too damn small. I want to make one massive. So before I even begin, you guys already know, because the DIY got back, because the gummy got back, something bad always happens. So I need, okay, I don't want, I need you guys to go down and smash that like button right now. Let's hit 200,000 likes, Wolf fan. Hurry up, I'm going to give you guys 10 seconds to hit that like button. 10. Hurry up, smash the like button, turn on the post notifications quick, 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 quick. Today I got just messing on the camera. Today we got whole store of gelatin, whole store of sugar. You don't got any new merch to drop or anything? Oh yeah. Check out the merch. Hurry up and cop some. The site is now up. It's selling like fire, guys. So hurry up. It got sold out so quick last time. Wolfyard.com. Wolfyard.com. Got corn syrup and stuff because we're gonna try something a little bit new today. Garden shears. Now you're wondering why do you got garden? Cheers. Most people would make a giant gummy worm with a giant gummy worm mold. We're ghetto on this channel. CPMs are low. So, this is the mold we are going to be using. This thing already is big enough to be the world's biggest gummy worm. We can shape it in this shape of Ryan Sweezy's favorite letter. An L. That's a backwards L. An L. An L. We can shape it into a W for Wolfie. Whatever shape you want, you can shape it into. So, without further ado, let's get it. Oh yeah, by the way, I almost forgot the most important ingredient. You guys know me for like the most sour drink in the world. We have malic acid. This is literally the epitome of sour. This is the acid in every candy, fruit, whatever it is, apples before they're ripe. It makes things sour. How do we know it's sour? Just take my word. Uh, I'm not no, gonna no. taste it. Right. Okay. Because you know I haven't been savage in a bit. You cannot fake this shit. Okay. I promise you. Go to the store and buy malic acid. You can't because you gotta order it online because that's how sour it is. There's literally warning saying don't take more than a spoon. <laughs> Yep, that's real. Your whole face freezes for a second. Yeah. We got the malic acid. Let's start by cooking the gelatin. Usually I would show this part, but honestly, it's very, very late at night. And your boy is actually trying to get some sleep. So I'm just going to fill this with water. I've done this a billion times. I was going to say, if you make a mess this time, this is your house. This is my house. So there's probably not going to be too much of a mess today, except for that. Same process is you boil the water, put it on the stove, turn the stove on, a little bit of heat right there, turn it on to high. You want all the heat. Bam. A little bit of fire on this side. Boom. High. Let these heat up a bit. So how today's gummy is gonna differ from pretty much any other gummy I made is we have Sour Patch Kids because they're obviously one of the best sour candies. Sour Skittles are another one of the best sour candies. Another supply that we never buy, and this is probably why every DIY I've ever made tastes like absolute dookie, we never got corn syrup. So I got two bottles of corn syrup. We're gonna be pouring a lot of that in there. We got these juicy drops. They have sour at the top that you like drip onto the lollipop, but the lollipop's not that sour. So the lollipops, though, we're purely just taking the sourness out of there. We have the two flavors of Jello. We're making strawberry Lime. The next step that we are gonna do is we are gonna mold this into the perfect gummy worm that we want. And apparently Dustin said this shit's mad hard. So this could take a while. First thing we wanna do is cut this piece of plastic off and not let it just start with this. No, you gotta cut the plastic off. Right. Even though plastic means nothing in this video, I'm teaching you guys life lessons. You need to be cutting plastic off. Plastic, so this is 100% recyclable. So we're gonna throw it in the compost. I'm sure that's not in the garbage. Now we're gonna learn how to shape it. This is the length we are working with. Now we gotta mold it into the shape of a worm. That was actually way easier than I thought. This is the shape we are working with right now. Dustin has done something similar to this, so he knows that each end has to point directly up so that the gummy does not leak out of the side. So the water is now officially boiling and it's nice and hot. Just like mixed that I'm gonna drop next week, guys. Hit the like button if you want to race gum disc track. The first step is to pour the corn syrup in, and it only works if you do two at once and you look super not seductive when you do it. So guys, we're gonna lube it up nice and sexual. I mean, nice and slow like this. Okay, that's not sexy at all. So there's one and yeah! Yeah! Question is, does corn syrup even have corn in it? Does it? Yes. Oh, thought you were gonna say. <laughs> Anyways, we got the corn syrup. Next up, the sucre, aka the sugar. That's good. I don't know. I don't even know. I, I don't measure, guys. I don't measure. And just like that, we turned all of the water white. Jesus walked on water, I walked on white water. We have a whole other one. We're gonna throw this one in the fridge. Because if you throw it in the fridge, trust me, 100 percent I'm not lying, it turns into diamonds. That's what's here, so we're gonna use the fish. No, I was gonna say we were missing something. Mix around the sugar for a bit until it completely condensates. This is the respiration, dedication, and most importantly, photosynthesis. I don't care what your teacher taught you in school. Your teacher has 7 million subscribers? Does your teacher have 7 million? I think not. Shut up, Prince. Try to film a video. We are also going to add in a dash of citric acid. It's essentially the Ryan Sways of malic acid. This is you versus the guy she tells you not to worry about, okay, guys? On your head top, first slip every time. This is way less sour than this, but this is still sour as hell, okay? Just a sprinkle. Just a little bit a sour. Just, okay. a, just a sprinkle right there, guys. Two shots of vodka. Two shots of vodka. 
as well as some Malik acid. Rumor has it Malik acid is actually related to Zayn Malik. Some of that. So now that we got those in there, we're gonna add a few sour skittles. Not too many because the more sour skittles we add in, the chunkier this is gonna be. Hopefully they don't stain the color. As well as the Sour Patch Kids. Or if you're Ryan Sways and you can't afford Sour Patch Kids, you go to Box Bar and you get Sour Munchkins. Yo, Dustin, I got a question for you, bro. What, what the f do you know about Juicy Drops? <laughs> what do you know about Juicy Drops? Let's get it! You don't want the suckers? Cut! Do not attempt that at home, kids. Do not attempt that at home. They're already starting to melt, so it's a good sign. Dustin's on the Jello duty. Try once we put in the jelly. All right, that's definitely. Let's do green first. Actually, oh, let's do red first. Red first. Red. No, 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 no. You don't want the packs in. I don't want the packs in. You're staining it right now, bro. You just made it so much harder on us. That shit's soggy now. Dustin's over. Dustin's over. Oh yeah, I love me some soggy Jello. That's probably gonna leak on my counter. Nasty. Bro, look at this. It just came over. Look how easy that is open. Yeah, yeah. Life hack. Life hack. So let's not get my whole house dirty because oh yeah, green, aka the Hulk, on the left. So that one is nice and green. Okay, on the counter. I open the garbage, but. Yeah, just go ahead. Great job, Dustin. Guys, I love Just Dustin. If you guys love Just Dustin, go subscribe to his channel. YouTube.com slash Just Dustin. Link in the description. Big gummy shipper. I troll him. So if you want to see him, be old. Then go to his channel. Link in the description. Now, guys, this is pretty red and this is pretty green, but it could always be redder and greener. So we got Christmas red icing coloring right here. This stuff is super red. We're going to do the same thing with this leafy green color. Please don't hate on the name. We're adding a lot in because the GLI BLI Pet Rat Guma, aka the gelatin, is definitely going to make it less green so if we make it more green technically uh, math something. instead of pouring it straight from the bag we're actually gonna go with the safe method here guys biz whisting it guys here does it clown a little bit of gli be like pet rat gumai in the green as well that is so satisfying to see you guys amazing yo guys if this gli be like pet rat gumai doesn't settle down on brushy Jeez. Me and Dustin just figured out why Lil Uzi Vert is called Lil Uzi Vert. Because this guy was pushing this to the edge. And if you think about it, this is green, Lil Uzi Vert. Bears! Green in French. What the f? All of his friends are dead. All of his gummy friends are dead. What the hell? Okay, guys, so I might have bought a little bit, just a little bit extra Gumai. Future Gumai videos, smash the like button if you want to see them. I think, like, to be honest, this is only like 10 bucks worth. It's like, it's not like it's definitely hundreds of dollars. Bum -ho, bum -ho. The next step is to skim off all of this extra foam off the top. You want to take paper towel on the top. Make sure your garbage can is nice and close. Bro, so, there's so much yeah, that there's like, a lot of foam. There's a lot of foam. Oh yeah, kind of satisfying. This can go in the moderately satisfying compilation. <laughs> oh yeah. So how we are going to fill this gummy worm to be 50% one color and 50% another color. We are going to do the green side first. We're gonna let half of it rest and bend this side all the way up so that only this side can get filled. We have to be very careful here because if we mess up, this stuff is ridiculously who my can that. There is so much gelatin in here. Oh my God, that's hot. That's hot, that's hot, that's hot. Okay, yeah, that's enough, that's enough. That's, more, that's way more than enough. Freezer's open. Make it go flat. Okay, it's gonna start leaking, bro. <laughs> Get something. Is this too high? It's too high. No, I, got, I got this in my hand. First of all, it's leaking. Where, where, where? We're old. Hold up, hold up. One layer. I need to do another layer. We're not prepared for this at all. I need to get something that's gonna hold it in place. Praying to God this doesn't leak because if I open the freezer and there is goo my can that everywhere. I hate the fact that we have to do 50% one color and 50% another color, but it looks like most gummy worms are two colors, so we're making it as accurate as possible, but it just makes it a little bit harder on us because if we were doing one color this would be easy peasy maybe we should do the downstairs freezer like it's bigger i think i don't know deeper yeah all right we're gonna go to the downstairs freezer this is the technique we have come down to guys bottom freezer we have more height we're using two bottles to hold it up it's pretty much a waiting game until that half freezes before we can put in the red half hopefully the red half does not solidify in that giant pot before we can put it in because that would completely over the bit so pray for me smash the like button guys i love you just took it out of the freezer it's been a while it's partly gummy you guys can see but it is gummy enough to mold so we got the red right here I kept it warm because I kept it on simmer. We might have a little too much extra goo my can die. Like we could have filled 40 of these. Hopefully the worm turns out good. Why is the red on this side? No, 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 no. So red in one side, there's red in the other side. I think it's because it's hot. We're gonna put this in the bottom freezer to freeze for like an hour or so, and we will be back. Hopefully, by that time the gummy worm is not completely over. 328. AM. So we just took it out of the freezer guys and this is what it's looking like as you can see if you look on the deep inside Completely solid. So now is the tricky part. We have the shears here We have to get it out and it should be the biggest gummiest sour DIY do my can die pet rat do my gam by can buy clout gang you already know in the world yeah. We could possibly mess up here, but 
Okay, so we finally got out of the tube. It took us an hour to do it. This is what we are working with. This is the world sour DIY gummy worm. As you guys can see, the heat of one of the liquids screwed up the other one. So now we got red all over the bottom, green all over the top. As you guys can see, the whole thing jiggles when I hit it. So technically, it's one piece. You know what I mean? Oh, it's coming. So now there is one last step. If you want to make it the sourest, we have to add citric and mallet. Now, both of those are already in there. But they're not on top of it. We're about to add them on top just for some extra sour. You know what I mean? So let's get it. Oh, yeah. Check out that. Ah, maybe a little bit on the sides as well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. <laughs> it's an instant cough. But with the malic acid, we have to be a little more safe. Please smash the like button. Look at how white this stuff is. It's like snow. The other stuff is. is not this white. You can smell the sourness of this. And just a little more because we don't mess around on my channel. A normal YouTuber would put a little bit. I'm just going to put a lot. Wipe around the edges. Because you got to take a thumbnail. You got to take a thumbnail. Without the thumbnail, you get no views. What are you going to title this? Rice gum diss track? Rice gum diss track. Slash eating semi big gummy worm. So now that this is fully powdered up, this is my favorite favorite time of the video guys you know I love to eat my DIY gummies they're always just so good <laughs> right I never yak <laughs> I don't know where my samurai sword is but I'm not even gonna bother getting that right now oh god this is wet and disgusting why am I doing this I wish there was more people here to test this with me it's just me and Dustin bro we're gonna have to it's do it's just you and you three two one <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh. Oh. oh the sound no, no. It's actually not bad. I don't, really? I swear to God. This is the first gummy I've ever made that actually tastes normal. I can't swallow it. Guys, no joke. You can taste the lime. You can taste the cranberry or raspberry, whatever we use. It's sour as hell. Yep. And it just gets more sour. My mm -hmm. lips are burning. But I'll taste it without the sour because there's no sour on the bottom. I'm actually swallowing it. That's like the perfect amount of sour. It got like spread out evenly throughout the whole thing. I think adding the corn syrup with like everything else definitely contributed to this. But this is dope. <laughs> No, no. Uh, that shit hits you so hard. One more. Ah! <laughs> oh, oh, that's aggressive. Boom! You can't swallow it. Dustin, you're up. Dustin's up, but guys, before Dustin goes, all right, we're not doing a clapping world record, relax. I'm crying a bit, my nose is dripping a bit, but I was just telling Dustin, these Sour Patch Kids and the Sour Skittles taste like Sweet Patch Kids now. My tolerance just went up so high. It tastes like I took one of those pills that make sour sweet. Did I do that? Those pills take so long to swallow. If you guys hit 200,000 likes on this video, there's these pills that I have that make everything sour super sweet. I will make the sourest gummy, whatever you guys want, comment it down below. And I will take that pill and try it with that if you guys hit 200,000 likes. So hurry up, hit that like button. All right, Dustin. Okay, take a big bite. Oh my God. This is not a joke. You cannot fake that sour face, guys. It's not bad at all. You're spitting on my floor, bro. Chill, 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 chill. This thing is still drinking. That's well water. Your water is That's well water. That's well water. <laughs> The fridge water is so slow. I hate gummy. The taste is flawless. The taste is good. Okay, so the taste test is done. I think we should kind of destroy this thing. Look at how thick this gelatin is. Jesus. Look at the inside oh, of that, Why didn't bro. we do this to start? This I don't even We should have took like slices. Ugh. Why does that look like uh, sour cherry blaster? That's exactly what I was going to say. Why does, bro? Holy. What? <laughs> yo, 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 look yo. at that. That's perfect. You know what's cuttable? It is very hard to cut, but I think we should melt it. Melt in your hand instantly. Start. Half of it melted on one side, oh my God. half of it melted on the other side, and you have like a little gummy ball that's actually not even hot at all in the middle. Will it blend? Oh. Yes. No. No. Oh. I gave it the biggest <laughs> ball thing ever. Yeah. Gumai smoke. Don't breathe this. Where did the white come from? It blended? The Mountain color acid. right out of it. Who wants some of this? Oh! Oh my god! Give me 10 bucks, take a spoonful of that. No part of me wants to do this. Oh, it looks like a freaking egg salad sandwich. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is so much work. <laughs> Whose lunch lady brought this to my house right now? If you can swallow a bite of that, I'll do whatever you want in the next bit. It's burnt. Oh, oh it's a, No, you. No! Ah! Oh! On that note, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to go down and smash that like button. Let's hit 200k. For every like button we hit, we're gonna be donating twenty dollars to every Ryan Swayze in the world. So make sure to hit that like button. I love you guys so much. There's a banger video over here. Banger video over here. Go watch them right now. You already know what it is. Post notifications. Click that bell right below me and turn them on. And I will see you guys soon with another banger video. And as always, stay savage. Let's go.